Welcome to Off Grid with Dave and Sonia. I'm Dave, and today we're going to see how much power this sous vide uses to cook these three steaks. This Anova sous vide is a immersion circulator. So right now the water temperature is at 45 degrees, and I have it set for 140. So once we start it, that it's going to heat the water. There's a heating element in this section, and then there's a fan down here at the bottom. So it'll get the water to 140 degrees. And then we'll cook these three steaks for one hour submerged in the water. So let's reset the meter. And now we'll start the heater. Now put this little cover on so that it keeps the, the heat in here. Keep the moisture down. The regular lid doesn't have a big hole in it, so we made our, our own cover. So you can see the temperature starting to go up. This is a 900 watt sous vide. So right now we're using 790 watts while it's warming up. So it's not quite the 900 that the back of the unit says. We are at our desired temp right now, 140 degrees. Let's see how much power we used. We used 0.42 kilowatt hours, or that's 420 watt hours. So now let's put the steaks in. If you got all the air out, they shouldn't float. Make sure it's all under the water. Put the little makeshift cover back on and we'll go for one hour so it's been one hour now let's pull the meat out steaks look at that steak got three of those So what we're going to do now is I'll put these in the refrigerator for a little bit, let them get cooled down. That way that gives us a little bit extra time to put on the skillet so we can sear the sides. So you don't want to put it on the skillet and keep cooking it. So if we put it in the fridge, let it cool for, I don't know, 30 minutes or so, and then we'll put it on a, on a skillet, two minutes per side, and we'll crisp up the edges. So let's see how much power we used. So we've used 0.63 kilowatt hours, or that's 630 watt hours. And that was for an hour and 45 minutes. So an hour of cooking, 45 minutes of preheat. So the preheat used most of it. I think we said it was 420 watts. So we've used so we've used an additional 210 watt hours to do the rest of the cooking. So in summary, we use the sous vide. It's an immersion cooker. We used it to cook three steaks. So it took 45 minutes to preheat the water, which was the water from our trailer. It's 50 degrees outside, so the water was 45 degrees. So it took it a little bit extra time to heat it as opposed to just using house water, which is probably about 60 or 70. So we used 630 watts total, 420 of them were to do the preheat, 210 was to do the final cooking, it was 140 degrees to cook. The leftover water that was left over from cooking, I put into this cooler, so we can use it for dishes or to take showers.
if we were out in the woods. We could use the heater to heat it up to a higher temperature, 180, um, 150, mix it with some other water in a five gallon bucket and use that to take a shower with. So we'll have other videos for that in the future. But if you want to see us finish cooking these steaks um, over, uh, over coals, uh, watch this video in the link up above. I'll have links to the sous vide in the description below. All right, David took the water from the sous vide, put it in here when he was done so that we can use it for dishes. Now you can see the, the steam coming up here. No, no. Let's see if we can catch it. Let me see it over here. Mm -hmm. There you go. Yep. <clears throat> so if you ever need to make hot water, need to do dishes, take a shower, your sous vide will do the job. If you like videos like this, subscribe to our channel up here and watch these other videos down here.